In order to investigate the bird further, I make an incision with the scissors down at the angle of the jaw and crunch through, following your scissors down. That will reveal the tongue and on the tongue are small papillae. These are small cartilaginous fingers which stop the food when the bird is picking it up from being dropped out of the mouth. We also have a cleft in the roof of the mouth and that's perfectly normal in the bird and is called the coanal cleft. Also we have the laryngeal area with the laryngeal cartilages and air flows through the nostrils down the, through the coanal cleft and into the windpipe. I also make a cut across the beak at right angles, just at the level of the nostril. That then reveals the sinuses. Just like we have sinuses, these are filled with air and have very, very fine bones. That is another ad adaptation for flight, to keep the head very light. If infection gets into this area, these bones can accumulate discharges like pus so that when you squeeze them pus will come out. The fine bones in the sinus area called nasal turbinates are primarily there to warm the air as it goes down into the body to help with gas exchange. I have opened up the skin just by using my thumb to pull away the superficial layers of, of skin and feather to reveal the windpipe or the trachea made of many cartilage rings and is very sturdy. The structure at the side is the food pipe and that is called the esophagus. The bird does not have any ability to suck food or water so when you see birds drink they have to dip their beak into the water and lift their head back and allow gravity to... The bird doesn't have a suck reflex so the bird has to dip the beak into the water and lift the head back and that lifting the head back allows gravity to to work and water will fall down into the lower parts of the digestive tract. The windpipe can have various problems. It is one of the main areas where we will see diseases of the respiratory tract such as viruses and occasionally we will see worms. That's the gape worm which will sit down in the windpipe. You can hear that the, these cartilaginous rings are very strong and maintain a patent airway. This colour is perfectly normal, pink showing healthy tissue.